Good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Good morning, good morning everyone. We have just left the truck stop. Now we're making our way home, sweet home. Yes. I think I got far enough yesterday where I can make it across the border and make it home. Now it's going to be a long day, but uh, we should be able to make it home. I got about 670 miles to go from the truck stop to home, but uh, that should be doable. You're just gonna have to keep her steady, and then we should be able to do it. I would be really happy if I could do it, as long as we can get to that border within our 11 hours, we're good to go. As soon as I cross over into Canada, I have 13 hours that I can drive. So then I can uh, easily make it home because it's only an hour and 15 minutes from the border to home. So if I get to the border at 11 o'clock, uh, my 11 uh, o'clock uh, timestamp for my hours for the US, then I'm in good shape. still have two hours to get home so let's give it a give it a good shot and see what happens I'm just kind of <laughs> having to let go of this green stuff that we got up here already up here it's not as green as it was even further down yesterday but that's just the way it is I guess anyways that's have ourselves a good day Thank you guys for uh, joining me on my travels and my daily life, whatever I'm up to. Sometimes the videos are not as interesting as other days, but we're trying to, to make it as interesting as we can for you guys. So with that, we shall be back in a second. Alrighty guys, I am in Walmart at uh, Suck Center, Minnesota, and I want to show you guys something. This stuff right here, it's a floor polishing product and they do not have it in Canada at uh, no store at all, not even in Walmart. So if any of you guys are working at Walmart in uh, Canada, I would say uh, maybe talk to your management. Maybe we could get this stuff in, uh, in Canada. That way I don't need to buy it here in the United States. Because my friends always want to, uh, to get this stuff, so uh, hey, I have to get it. <laughs> Even my wife uses it. We have hardwood flooring, you know, so I have to use that too. So, but anyways, let's do some more shopping. Alrighty, guys, we came back from shopping. Got my cart full of stuff up here. Got me some of this uh, bug cleaner wash and <clears throat> opened up the hood. And now I'm going to uh, throw in some uh, some cleaner here. I don't know if I can throw the camera up here. We'll give this a try. Hopefully this will work. Yeah, there we go. Get me my glove. Open this thing up and uh, some bugs are coming out, you know, so we'll throw some, uh, some of this stuff in there and it's supposed to help clean the bugs off better, you know. Mm. Anyways, we're just gonna fill everything up and make our way back home.
there we go. Anyways, let's go take everything uh, inside the truck and then uh, we'll get out of here. Alrighty guys. We are done with our shopping. And I'm just looking at them guys over there. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it, but there's a couple of girls up there that are doing a couple of dances up there. <laughs> they were, I think, preparing for some kind of dance. I figured I honk at him. <laughs> oh, well, that's funny. Anyways, let's get out of here. It's a beautiful day out here today again, like it's been for the last couple of days. Had a little bit of drizzle there earlier, but uh, now we're in the good again. Got nice sunshine, and we are making our way home. Yes, sir. Yeah, we probably have about six and a half hours drive yet to home or maybe even seven, but we'll see. Alrighty guys, we just passed through Fargo, North Dakota. Now we are finally on the last stretch going home. About 217 miles to go. Then we will be home sweet home. Yes, sir. -y. I can't wait to get home. It's been a long day already, and I got about another four hours to go. Oh well, that's the way it goes. Luckily, it's not crazy windy today, so we are good in that department. Anyways, we are cruising along. It's been a good day, though. I have nothing to complain about really, other than being a long day. <laughs> oh well, I guess you can always complain about something if you really want to. But I try not to. I try to stay positive. Yep, that's what I try to do. Anyways, let's put the hammer down and get home as soon as we can. Alrighty guys, we have just entered Manitoba. Yeah, -ha! we are home, home, home. Not quite, but we are on the home stretch. Only about an hour and 15 minutes and we will be home. The sun is just about to go down. Yeah, still up a little tiny bit, but not much. But I am excited. It's Friday, and I'm almost home. Yep, got a little bit of a line up at the border, but not too shabby, not too shabby. Yep, got everything taken care of. We crossed the border. We made it right with our 11 hour time. I was five minutes before 11 hours that I crossed the border, so yeah, we got her done. I left 7.55. I left the boot, he has already stamped my paperwork. So that means about four and a half minutes to spare on our 11 hour clock. I exit the United States. That's the way to do it. Not after 11 though. <laughs> Before 11 hours, that's the way to do it. But that's all that matters. We got it done. It was a tight one, but we got it done. Now we're on the Canadian Arts Service. And now we don't have to worry about uh, running out of hours for another two hours. I have two hours to get home. Yep. So let's get down the road and make our home safely and call it a day.
time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come. 